With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Four particle is of mass m charge q are held at vertices of a square of side a. They are released at t equals to zero and move under the mutual repulsive force. Speed of each particle when its distance from the center and the center of the square double. So if you see we want the distance of the particle from the center to be doubled and initial the side length was a. So if you see now each particle here are at the edges of this square like here, here, here and here. So if you see here initially the distance from the center is if you see this whole length is a by root 2 and this will this length will be uh, this whole length is a root 2 and this length will be a by root 2. We want this a by root 2 to be double. See? So when it will be double let's say the uh, the side of the square so they will always form a square from the symmetry. Let's say the side of the square is a dash. So a dash by 2 will be the distance from the center and we want it to be 2 times of this. So basically we want the side length of the square to be 2 times to become 2 times. When the distance from the center will become 2 times so the side length will also become the 2 times here. So if you see here there will be 6 pairs right. If you see there are 4 charges and from 4C2 you can see here it will be 6 4C2 it is 4 into 3, 4 minus 1 by 2 that is 6. So there will be 6 pair here and you can see already that adjacent 4 pair and diagonal 2 pair. So we can uh, write down the mechanical energy conservation that initially the kinetic energy is 0 and initially potential energy is something. Finally we, we want the kinetic energy. Right. So if you see let's say the finally they, they all have velocity v0 and from symmetry they all will have the same velocity. So if I, if I write down the kinetic energy of the system it will be this where v0 is velocity of the 4 particle. Velocity of magnitude of the velocity of each particle. From the symmetry they all will have the same velocity right. So this will be the expression right. Uh, so I will write down from here the final kinetic energy that is 2 m v naught square is equals to right. It will be equals to initial minus final. So, if let's write down the expression for the initial and final potential energy. So, as I said you, there are four pairs of adjacent charges. Right? So, adjacent charges are 1, 2, 2, 3, 3, 4, right? uh, like so. So, adjacent charges will have, let's say, a potential energy this. It will be K. If you see the charges on the particle is Q. So, I will write down kq square by a only. Right? And because of the diagonal, it will be having kq square by this length is a by root a root 2, right? This length is a root 2. So, there are two diagonal pair. You can see two diagonal pair a, a root 2 and a root 2. a root 2 and a root 2. So, I, so if I write down the expression for potential energy, it will be. 4u1 plus 2u2. 2 diagonal plus 4 adjacent. Right. So, you can put the value. It, is, it will be 4 kq square by a and 2 kq square by root 2. So, it will be 4 kq square by a. Right. And here it will be 2 kq square by root 2. So, it will be root 2 kq square by a. So, you can put this expression in the mechanical energy conservation. So, I will write down 4 plus root 2 kq square. 
so only a is changed right so i will write down yes this is the change in potential energy all right so you can uh, subtract it and this will be equals to the final kinetic energy that that terms is already written here so it will be 4 plus root 2 kq square by 2a and if you take this 2m terms also this side it will be equals to v naught square and if i take under root you will get the v naught and this is the answer of this question 4 plus root 2 kq square by 4m a now you can check for the option so if you see you can divide this 4 term and you will get it will it will be 1 plus root 2 by 4 is 1 by 2 root 2 right so if you see this expression so you can see here there is m a in the denominator not m a square so here it is written m a square so a will be the correct one thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students Download Doubt and App today.